And this is me. To start things out, I have to tell you that my life is shit. And I've been thinking about killing myself a lot lately. I'm not generally a depressed person, or at least I didn't used to be. This begins my story, the story of the last six months of my life. I didn't really believe in the whole paranormal or future telling thing, and don't ask me why I came here. I guess I was just bored. Yeah, I was just bored. I'm not sure if Madame Relisco was having a bad day, or if she just hated me. <laughs> but after leaving that place, nothing has been the same. <laughs> it's almost like my brain has been rewired by voodoo oh, bullshit. Is dead? Um, book. The book was actually titled... <laughs> Understanding Communism, with a cheap homemade cover. I don't really understand it. And that laugh, I will never forget it. That laugh haunts me while I sleep. The next day I noticed a lot of strange things, like my body deciding when and where it wants to lose its balance. Most of the time, my arms also stiffen, which makes it almost impossible for me to catch myself. Yeah, I used to be good with the women. Well, maybe not this good, but I can embellish a little, can't I? Do you want to see a clip of the third and last time I tried to talk to a woman that I actually found attractive? It's a little embarrassing, but I guess it's a part of the story, so here we go. <laughs> What's up, you nasty piece of bitch? What? Nasty piece of bitch? Uh, it doesn't even make sense. I've went days without eating because of this. Obviously not by choice. My hand decides when it wants to put food in my mouth and when it wants to fling food all over myself. And sometimes the stuff that it puts in my mouth is not food at all. Mm. Not my proudest moment, mm. but yes, that's dirt. <coughs> I'm eating dirt. If you can't talk to me while I'm puking, then you don't really love me. <laughs> Ah! Yeah. Ah! Oh! Mm. Ah! No! Oh! Ah. Yeah. <coughs> yeah. <coughs> yeah. <coughs> so, here I sit, back in present day. Beer after beer after beer. For some reason, my cursed body never resists those. It's much easier to get drunk on an empty stomach. Yeah, I've tried to go to the doctor, but my body refuses to go. When I want to turn the car to the right, I go left, and vice versa. I do the same thing when walking sometimes. And I did know that that would never work. The gun misfires, the rope breaks. The car I throw myself in front of 
turns out to be an expert stunt driver and will always miss me. You may see me around town. I'll be the guy smashing my face into the pavement. You can come up and talk to me if you like, but if you're a pretty girl, I'm gonna insult you. Trust me, that's not what I want to do. So, I'll be on my way. This is my story. Thanks.